Good morning, Riverside Otters. It's Miss Leslie here with Mrs. E. Hi, guys, and welcome to another amazing broadcast. We have a couple announcements, so we're going to jump right on into those announcements. Our first announcement is about the food box drop information. We have such an amazing community, and the City of Rochester, Channel One, Family Service Rochester and Cradle to Career have teamed up to provide awesome food box drop. So here's the information you guys need if you need any extra food. On Friday, May 15th from 1230 to 1.30, you can head to these four locations to pick up these boxes. You can head to the Empowerment Center, Boys and Girls Club, Cook Park, or Bear Creek Park to pick up the food boxes. And we just wanted to wish everybody a happy Mother's Day. Thanks to all of the mothers, stepmothers, grandmas, aunts, and special women out there. We hope all of you had a lovely day on Sunday. The final announcement is about school item pickup. All right, you guys, so there's lots of information with this one, and there were emails that were sent out about it, so you can always head back to those emails to get more information. But families may pick up their items on Monday, May 11th, and as you can see, there are different times for different letters. So how we did it is we organized alphabetically by last names. Now, there are two different time options as well. So if you miss your time on Monday, May 11th, don't worry, there's a secondary time on Tuesday, May 12th. But please remember they go by alphabetically by last names, just so we can make sure that we're spreading people out and we're still under the keeping distance and making sure that everyone is healthy and safe. So if you need more information about when your time is, you can look at this slide, freeze the slide, or you can also check those emails that were sent out. All right, now it's time for shout outs. Our first shout out is from Mrs. Anderson. She said that they had a great time on their Google Meet call this week. They went on a pretend trip to Disney World, read a Clifford story, and learned about new art projects. Look at how many kids came to their Google Meet. That is awesome. And we just wanted to give a quick shout out to community member Diane Adams. A big thank you to her because Diane donated a lot of fleece to Riverside. And now Ms. Laura, Ms. Susie, and Ms. Janet have been making blankets with that fleece. So the blankets will be donated to people who are in need of a nice toasty blanket. So thanks, Diane. That was a really generous gift. We appreciate it. Our next shout out is from Mrs. Franzone, and she wants to shout out to Johan for his response to last week's counseling lesson about playing fairly with others. So take a look at this video that he made. Say, do you want to play with me? I can be your friend. <laughs> so cute. And Mrs. Franzone and Mrs. Baines wanted to shout out some of the Star Wars projects that Ms. Franzone's students worked on. Students were asked to draw a Star Wars character or scene and then record the Star Wars theme. So check these out. First one's by Ruby. The second one is by Jerry. Oh, I love the explosions. There's two more, too. We've got Johan and Alwalid doing their Star Wars projects. I see those X-Wing fighters in there. Oh man, it makes me want to go watch Star Wars again. All right, 
Great. And our next shout out, of course, is from Penny Sunshine and Roses. We want to give her a huge shout out and thank you. You guys, we have been receiving so many of your pictures of your amazing artwork that you did. I love all of the owls and so many different designs. So there were 215 kits that were handed out. And seriously, the, the paintings that you guys created were magical, okay? There will be another opportunity to paint with Penny later this month on May 22nd, and we are so excited. So keep taking a look at all of these pictures that you guys sent in. Oh, so wonderful. And I love that each one is a little bit different, that you guys put your own spin on it. I love those little owl eyes looking at me. <laughs> they just make me happy. Okay. Oh, it was fun to see all those great pictures. Now, if you get a chance sometime this week, you can still stop by school and you can pick up one of these community art project postcards. And if you've already gotten one, make sure you get that in the mail and it's going to come back to us at Riverside. So I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful week. All right, you guys, thank you so much for tuning into our broadcast. And there'll be another broadcast coming again next week. So, you guys, again, we love you. We miss you. and can't wait to see you again. And as always, how we finish our broadcast on three. Go Otters. Ready? One, two, three. Go, Go Otters! otters.